Guys, we just finished a podcast with Alice Little and Cressa Kisses. They are, what do I call you guys again? Courtesans. They have sex with people for money, and they're gonna have sex with me soon. And we talked about Dance at the ranch. we talked about squirting. We talked about everything, and Jess kissed a girl. <laughs> and we put condoms on with our mouths. Check it out. I'll put the link down there. SoundCloud.com/slash Shane and Friends. Bye. Hey, what's up, you guys? Oh my God, I have never been this scared in my life. I'm scared. I'm nervous. I'm nervous because today I'm gonna be trying a food that I have not had since I was a very little kid. Well, a very big little kid. Actually, I was never a kid. Since I was a little 45 year old lesbian woman. And that is Wiener Schnitzel. I know, it's fucking horrifying. Now, over my YouTube life, I have talked so much shit about Wiener Schnitzel. And I know they say all dogs go to heaven, but bitch, I drag those dogs to hell. I even came up with a list one time of the top three fast food places people will go right before they kill themselves. And guess what was number one? Wiener Schnitzel, bitch. So I'm just hoping that this food is so nasty that I won't feel bad about talking so much shit about it over my entire life. But if it's good, then I'm gonna have to make it apology video. I'm gonna have to delete all my videos where I was talking shit about Wiener Schnitzel. And I'm gonna have to un-RSVP my invitation to the hashtag Wiener Schnitzel is over party. It's just too complicated. So here we go. I have two big filled bags of Wiener Schnitzel and I'm fucking ready. Also on the back of the bag it says share our Wiener love. I kind of like that. I think Wiener Schnitzel just came out. Okay, I got so many things. I don't even remember what I got. All I know is as I was ordering it, I kept going <laughs> after each one. And the woman that was working at Wiener Schnitzel was like, I get it. Also, nobody in there was wearing gloves. And listen, I hate condoms. So I understand actually wanting to touch the wiener and having no barrier. But when I'm gonna put that wiener in my mouth, maybe you shouldn't just be touching it. Cause honestly, that makes me nervous. Okay, here we go. Let's get right into it. Oh God. Oh, whoa. This one, she comes in a box. <laughs> It says taking over the world one hot dog at a time. I disagree, unless that world is my toilet. All right, here we go. Here comes my apology video. This looks bomb. Hold on, get a close up of that. That shit looks good. I don't know what this is. I think it's like a chili dog with bacon and extra cheese and ooh, bitch. <laughs> Oh no, I really want to hate this. Okay, but, ooh, oh, ooh, some bacon fell on my lap. It's not the first time I've had a pig on my lap. I have very low standards. Oh my god, oh, fuck. Okay, I just dropped the box, the dog is fine. Oh my god, okay, hold on. Get a real close up of that. Look at that, look at it dripping. Oh my god. I don't even like hot dogs, but this looks bomb. Okay, let's do this. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Why did you lie? Oh my god, oh my god. That tastes like a nickel. I can't explain it. Put a nickel in your mouth. That's exactly what it tastes like. It tastes like metal. This is not, this is like Stranger Things. Like you should not be eating this. You're gonna go into a fucking portal. A fucking tree person is gonna eat your legs off. I'm fucking barred. This is not good. The presentation is everything. I mean, you take a picture with this on Instagram, you have any likes you're gonna get. You're gonna get so many likes that your life is gonna actually feel worth something. But then the next day you're gonna take a picture of just your face and you're gonna get like a quarter of the likes and then you're gonna remind yourself that like, yeah, you don't mean shit. Anyways, uh, this is gross. I hated it. It's shitting out the bottom. I don't trust that. It was like sugary and not in a good way. God, it looks so good though. Like, look at that. Doesn't that look good? Fuck. Huh. And then, you know what though? Okay, the actual like presentation is everything, but then when you pull out this fucking thin ass pencil dick <laughs> from all that chili, like, nah. You know what I mean? Like on a dating app, yeah. Once again, low standards. But in my mouth, well, yeah, still. But as food, nah. Next. By the way, isn't chili dogging like a term for anal sex if you haven't cleaned your ass out? Which, by the way, would taste better than that. All right, let's see what we got next. Ooh, what is this little box? Ooh, it comes with a fork. It actually came with about five forks because I ordered so much food. Nope, just chili dogging myself. Okay, this is the box, and on top it says, when in doubt, chili it out. I'm sorry, what? You needed to take another few minutes in that boardroom meeting, Wiener Sizzle. Like, I feel like somebody threw that out there, and then y'all were like, fuck it, I just wanna go home, chili it out. It could have been like, Netflix and chili? Is that chili, or did my ass make a silly? What's the dealie? Get me some chili. I can come up with them all day. All right, here we go. <sighs> Once again, presentation is fucking killing it. Look at that fucking chili cheese ass motherfucking fries, bitch. 
bitch. Oh my god. Oh, and the cheese is like perfectly melted. Ooh, and the fries are crispy. Okay, if this isn't good, I'm gonna be really pissed because I'm rooting for her. I feel like I'm watching Miss America and she just tripped, but her bikini is everything. She has stretch marks, but that's what makes her real. She has shaving bumps, but who doesn't? She has a wandering cockeye, but so do I. I just want her to succeed. She won't, she'll lose, and she'll probably say something racist during her question and answer, and she'll probably come up the sex date. But you know what? Who doesn't? All right, here we go. I'm going to try a mouthful of Miss America. <laughs> All right, here we go. <coughs> oh, oh my God. I figured it out. Problem is the chili. The chili is so salty. The chili is saltier than my Twitter feed on Teen Choice Award night. The chili is saltier than the comment section on my Instagram when I take a picture showing my legs. It's just wrong. Like chili is good, but this, this is not chili. That should be their slogan. <laughs> this is not chili. Hi, welcome to Wiener Sitzel. Where everything looks good and tastes like ass. That could be my slogan. No, wait, everything looks bad and tastes like ass. Yeah, that's my slogan. Cause let me see, let me try the actual fry. And if the fry tastes good, then we know the problem is the chili. The problem is all of it. <laughs> all right, next item, I'm happy because honestly, if these would have been good, I would have been angry. So honestly, I'm just living for this negativity. I hope you are too. Thumbs up if you are. Next item. Let's see if we can get to 500,000 negativity thumbs up. I just really like spreading anger and hatred throughout YouTube. Oh God, oh God. Speaking of anger and hatred, this is something that I have never tried. This is something I've never wanted to try. This is something similar to getting my belly button pierced that like, I don't want to try and nobody wants to see me try. Oh my God. Oh, I don't want to touch it. Oh God, oh God, oh God. Ew, 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 it's a fucking relish dog. Oh, ha! Ah. Mm. Ooh, I'm not even nervous right now. Oh, this is giving me a hashtag O2L oh, forever, and that is not good. Okay, okay, guys, if you don't know this, I, I don't know how you wouldn't. Relish is my biggest nightmare. It's my biggest fear. You know how much I hate boogers. Like, I'm chill with every other bodily function. You got a poopy ass? I don't care. Chili dog it. You got a bloody ass pimple on your lip? I don't give a fuck. Let me lick it. You got a booger hanging out of your mouth? Why? We could be at our wedding day. The priest could say, do you, Shane, take this sad, sad person with no love for themselves and very low standards to be your awfully wedded husband and or wife by sexual goals. And I would look and I'd see a booger coming out of his or her mouth, equality wins. And I would barf in that motherfucker's face and run out the front door. Oh God. This is making me hangry. I just realized how similar hangry sounds to hangry. That's crazy. <laughs> Anyways, okay, here we go. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> okay, oh. <laughs> I'm actually shaking. I don't want to do this. I'm gonna do it. Okay. <laughs> no. Oh, I gotta do it. Right. <laughs> if you want to know what my first time sucking a dick was like, this is it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I breathed it in. I breathed it in. <sighs> okay. All right. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Oh my god, oh my, uh, uh, it's my tooth, it's my tooth, uh, uh, I got a hammer right now, I knock out my fucking tooth. I, 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 oh, I, I, superwoman, I, 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 <laughs> I hated that. I can't even make a joke about it. I fucking hated that. I don't want to remember that. I don't want to ever think about that. I don't even want to see that in this video. I'm not even gonna watch this fucking video back. Whoever came up with Relish, I hope they're dead. And they probably are dead, because Relish has been around since the beginning of fucking time. And nobody's ever liked it. It was like dinosaurs, cavewomen, and Relish. And guess what, bitch? Everything got extinct, except for the damn Relish. Because Relish is like, no, no, no. I'm gonna wait around for millions of years to fuck up Shane. And guess what, Relish? You succeeded, okay? But now it's time to go. All right, I need something good. I need something not Relish. I need something not chili. I need something. <gasps> <laughs> oh, I've never been more excited to see a corn dog in my life. Corn dogs are the shit. This is gonna be great. I don't care if it's a corn dog from Wiener Sizzle. I don't care if it's a frozen corn dog. Whatever it is, bitch, it's gonna go. Oh, <laughs> fucked up my camera a little bit. Hold on. Oh, there's relish on my napkins. Are we, oh, there, that's even worse. Oh, there we are. You know what, I looked much better when I was covered in grease. Okay, here we go. I'm going to try a corn dog and it better be great. Or at least like, not awful. This is great. This is amazing. They should just do this. <laughs> like, stick to the one thing you're good at. You know what I mean? This is wonderful. I love this. She smells good. She 
tastes good. Once again, the wiener is a little thin and there's a lot of space between the wiener and the actual corn dog. But like honestly, I'm all about pencil dicks. I feel like everybody's dick is beautiful. Unless it's covered in chili. Shit's fine. Chili, nah. All right, what else we got? Ooh, I didn't even know they had cheeseburgers. I feel like this might be okay. I feel like it's hard to fuck up a cheeseburger. I feel like there's, y'all just had a chili in that, didn't you? You obviously didn't hear my rant, Wiener Sizzle. Why? Oh, oh, <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> the bun feels good though. It's very wet. All right, I'm gonna just get in. I'm not gonna get, you already know what I'm gonna say. They fucked up. Next, what the fuck is this? This is special. I love that. Um, hi. Whose old fucking stupid aunt made this? <laughs> Who's a fucking relative who has no idea how to cook said, oh, you know what? Let me get this big ass nasty bread with nuts in it and slice a damn hot dog in half. This is some shit you would have if like your parents died and then you're shipped off to like some random relative's house and they've never cooked, they've never had kids, they don't know anything. And they're like, oh my God, I don't know, hot dog sandwich? That's what this is. This is the Raising Helen of food. And you know what Raising Helen got? A rotten tomato. And you know what this gets? My rotten ass. All right, let's just bite into that. Come on. You're not even trying anymore, Wiener Sitzel. You're not even trying. All right, here we go. Sorry, I'm just gonna have to Take out that nasty ass fucking pickle in the middle of my dick. Nobody wants that. Okay, here we go. No. <laughs> Who would order this? Who the fuck would order this? No. I have two things left, and I swear to God, if one of them is good, no, I asked for Poe taters because I thought they were just gonna be little taters, and now they're fucking covered in fucking chili again. You know what? I'm just gonna go for the bottom where there's not as much chili, and I'm gonna give her a try. That's great. This with corn dogs, that's all they should do. But then they start fucking throwing chili on everything because they think that that's their thing. That's not your thing. Don't let that be your thing. Think outside the box, Wiener Sensel. Don't let that control you. Don't be afraid to be different, Wiener Sensel. You know what? I'm rooting for you again. I feel like you're in a slump. Well, an entire like 20 year slump, like however long you've been around is what your slump has been. But you can get out of it. Just stop making chili. Become famous for something else or keep making chili, but then market yourself as like food if you need to throw up. You know what I mean? Like maybe you ate poison. Maybe you took too many pills. Like, oh no, I need to throw all this up. Give me a chili dog. Maybe that could be your thing. Cause making good food isn't. <laughs> Ooh, last thing. All right, I'm actually excited about this because I feel like nobody can fuck with a milkshake. This is a milkshake, but it's also a tasty freeze, which I've never had. And I guess that's like a fancy fucking popular kind of shake. I don't know. All I know is I'm ready for my palate to be cleansed or burned off. Literally rip out my tongue and kill it. Here we go. Oh my God. This is everything. Like when Michelle Branch wrote that hit song in 2001. You are everything to me. Wait, everything. That's not the song, is it? You are everyone to me. <laughs> what the fuck was that song? Oh no, it was. You are everywhere to me. When I close my eyes is. That's what it was. That song was about Jesus, by the way. Little known fact. Okay, this is everything. It's really good. You can see the fucking chocolatey goodness. This is killing it. You know what? Maybe if I dip a wiener dog in this, it'll help. Or no, like corn dog. Oh, bitch. We're getting creative. Oh my God, okay, here we go. Oh, oh my God. It's like I'm battering her up again. All right, here we go. That is so good. <laughs> wiener Sizzle, this is your thing. This is it. This is it, baby. I'll be your fucking spokesperson wiener. I'll be your spokes wiener. That's what they'll call me. This is great. Actually, <laughs> it was good until I got just like the littlest, weirdest chunk of a hot dog. When the dough is all wrapped up in it, it's great. When you get that little fleshy hot dog chunk, it's over. <laughs> Where you guys go? What was that? This just put me through puberty again. That's how terrifying it was. All right, guys, go. That was me trying Wiener Sitzel. Thank God it was gross. Now I don't feel bad for making fun of her. But listen, once again, if you love Wiener Sitzel, I hope this doesn't offend you. I don't need all the Wiener Army to come at me on Twitter. Like, do you. If you love Wieners, then love Wieners. If you love buns, then love buns. If you love both, buy my book. All right, you guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel right down below because I make new videos every fucking day. And if you want to see more videos of me eating fast food or weird food or more wieners, I'll put a link to a playlist at the top of the description below. All right, you guys, I will see you little hot dogs tomorrow. Bye. You know how I feel about pickles. And if you don't remember, I'll remind you. <laughs> that noise was incredible. And I'd like somebody to turn it into a trap beat. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah.